Hello, beautiful people of the evening, and my name is Rachel. Welcome back to my channel. If you guys do not know, my name is Rachel. This is my channel. Um, I know in last week's video, I said that I would be starting doing weekly vlogs. Well, here I am. It's midweek. <laughs> it is Wednesday, January. Oh, oh my God, we're in February. February 14th. Happy Valentine's Day. Um, it is actually literally midday. I woke up at 10.30 this morning, and... <laughs> I'm driving the struggle bus today, i.e. my appearance. Also, I just came out of the shower. Well, I got out of the shower maybe an hour ago, and I'm just like not with it today. Anyway, it is Valentine's Day. Andre surprised me last night with some gift. I honestly wasn't expecting anything for Valentine's Day because we're not really big on Valentine's. Like, of course, we go out, we watch movies, we get dinner, things like that, but I'm not really big on Valentine's Day. Like, it's not really a holiday for me, so I didn't really care, and I really didn't expect anything, but he surprised me, so I want to show you guys what he got me. So, the first thing that he got me was this cute little bear right here. I named him Snowy, um, and I have all the teddy bears that he has given me over the years on the couch so this one is charlie that was last year's valentine's gift um this one is smoky that was our first uh year of valentine's and now this is snowy so also got me these beautiful roses the last thing that he got me was his card which says a man like me has a lot to be thankful for that just like literally melted my heart because i honestly did not expect anything Good morning, beautiful pupil of the uni, and it is now day two of the vlog. Um, today is the next day. It is Thursday. Um, so this is our actual Valentine's Day for me and Andre. It's when we're actually celebrating it since we both have the day off. Um, I'm going to go get my nails done. Andre's going to get his hair cut or his beard shaped up. These little poopers. Hey, little baby. Hi, baby. She really has to go to the... I'm going to say it in Spanish because they don't know Spanish. They definitely know the word in English and they get crazy. So I'm going to go to the nail salon, which is literally three minutes up the street. That's why I love living in this area. Um, go get my nails done. I'm probably going to grab breakfast before I go. Then we come back and I'm going to film my get ready with me because I think then I'm going to do my makeup. And then we're going to go watch Fifty Shades of Freed, which I am so excited for and then after that um we'll probably have a little bit of time which i'm gonna try to bang out some homework before then and then we have dinner reservations for seven right babe so, yeah so for seven o'clock we're going to easy bond which i don't know if i talked it about talked about it yesterday but easy bond is like this korean barbecue place where it's like you can cook your meat in front of you and it's all you can eat like sushi soup salad Ugh, i'm so freaking excited today we are not doing our diet today we are not doing our diet but for sure we'll make it a point to go to the gym this week to knock off all that uh weight we're about to leave so i wanted to do an ootn I'm just wearing this V-neck, this like blue, navy blue V-neck shirt with my blue ribbed boyfriend jeans and my Jesus sandals that Andre freaking hates me wearing these sandals, but they're so comfy. I love them so much. And also I'm wearing them because Andre decided to pamper me. So I'm also getting my feet done as well. So for sure wearing my Jesus sandals, even though you don't like them. I think they're so cute. No. No. Bunnies are cute. Puppies are cute. Bunnies. They're cute. Bunnies. <laughs> So I just got done getting my nails done. Um, I'll show you guys here. I got SNS, um, which is basically like a dip powder, and I love these because these last so long. And but I just wanted to speak a little bit and do like a little rant because the lady next to me who is also getting her nails done, she was so incredibly rude to the nail tech who is doing her nail. Like, I guess that she was basically on her break from work to get her nails done, but 
she was like rushing the lady and rushing the process and being so rude she was like cursing at her and everything and her nails were like incredibly short like sns like my these are my real these are my real nails they just put powder over them um but except this one because this one broke off like literally this morning so they just put a tip so that way you can match my other nails but these are actually my real nails and they just have powder on them um and it just makes it harder and it kind of gives it like the acrylic effect without actually putting on the glue the glue and all that kind of stuff except for this nail but her nail was like really really short and she was being so rude she was like oh I want them squared and blah 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 and she kept looking at my nails and I think what she was trying to go for was my nails but she didn't understand that she couldn't like her nail tech was trying to explain to her like look like your nails are too short like I can't do that I can't make them square and she's like well they look ugly and they're rounded and she's like well because your nails are short and she's like well I want to get acrylic and they didn't have anyone at the store at that time who was not busy to go ahead and do acrylic and she was like cursing at her and she's like oh I'm so annoyed you can't even do your job blah 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 why would they even hire you if you don't know how to do it? like she was being so rude to this lady and I felt so uncomfortable and I felt so sorry for her and it was just because she was trying to achieve a look um without really without like she was trying to achieve like getting a squared nail look but she didn't have the nails to make it square and like the natural shape of her nail was kind of like a rounded almond shape so she couldn't achieve that look and that's what her nail tech was trying to tell her but she was just being so freaking rude and like so impatient and I was just I felt so sorry for her and honestly guys like these people like they work so hard and they do their jobs and like don't be rude to people like there's no reason to be rude i understand that like you're busy and like you're trying to get things done on like a time schedule and all that kind of stuff but if you know that certain things like going to get your nails done is something that's going to take at least two hours don't go on your break do it on a time where you have x amount of time to go ahead and allot that time to that specific activity and don't get angry because something that you want you can't have and you're basically making that person like making your problem that person's issue like i felt so bad i felt so 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 bad and i was just like i she was she was being nice and she didn't show attitude and like i was like girl more power to you because i would have told that bitch get the fuck out of my store hey guys so i'm back inside now i made it home um just in case i didn't show you my hands are a little wet but these are my nails again these are my real nails um i just got sns over them which is basically just dip powder um except this one i had to put a tip on because um it broke off earlier this morning which i was really mad every time i go to get my nails done something always messes up with my nails <sighs> all right guys so let's get freaking started first things first on the real list for well first things first i need to take off these eyebrows because i did put on eyebrows and eyelashes well not really eyelashes, but I put on eyebrows and mascara today. I am much done taking off my makeup. Ding! I'm not really big on primer, but if I am using primer, I use the NYX pore filter. Um, it mattifies my face as well as um, it kind of like minimizes my pores, which I don't really have big pores, but around my nose area, I do. And that's just, that's not cute. And I apologize in advance if you guys keep seeing me turn this way because I have my vanity mirror. Bleh, bleh. Espanol. <laughs> I have my vanity mirror right over here. So I'm like looking at that. Okay, girl. You need to get... Uh, homegirl needs to get some more <laughs> primer. I put that all over my face. First, I'm going to start off with foundation. Now, I am going to be mixing. So, I have Fenty Beauty, and I also am an Urban Decay junkie. Till the day I die, I will use Urban Decay. Um, however, Fenty is not as full coverage as I would like it to be, and Urban Decay is as full coverage as I want it to be. However, Fenty right now is my current shade, and this is like half a shade lighter than what I actually am so I'm putting two pumps of Fenty on the back of my hand and I'm in the shade um 370 and then for Urban Decay I think I'm yeah in the shade 9.0 
So I'm just gonna pump actually one pump at the back of my hand because this one is very, very full coverage. So as you guys can see, Fenty is actually more like a more of an uh, orange undertone and the Urban Decay one is more of a neutral undertone. Um, as you can see, Mama is like, I got freaking whoa. All right, so now I'm gonna use the Morphe Contour Beauty Blender and I'm just gonna go in and just put that all over my face. Next, I'm gonna go in with the Urban Decay Naked Skin Concealer. Um, weightless Complete Coverage Concealer. So extra. I'm just gonna cover up some of my blemishes and as well as my acne marks because those are not cute. And then I'm gonna go in with the original Beauty Blender and just blend that out. Okay, I'm gonna go in with, this is the same concealer. Um, I'm just, this is just one shade lighter than I am or I think it is two shades lighter, don't remember. But I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, brighten up my under eyes. And now I'm going to use the Morphe Contour Beauty Blender and I'm just going to blend that out. Now to set my under eyes, I am going to use the Anastasia Medium to Tan Contour Tit, Contour Tit, Tit, <laughs> Contour Kit. And ugh, I'm going to use this shade, which I believe is their banana powder. At least I believe so and I really hope so because that's what I've been calling it all this time. And I'm just gonna put that in there, all up in your face, cause you are a sexy cool chick, sexy cool chick, woo woo. I am going to beat the hell out of this thing to hopefully shake up what's ever left in here, by the grace of God, which by the way, I think you can only buy these at Macy's now if they still have them, if they're in stock and if they're in your color. I believe, okay, this is the e.l.f. powder brush, my favorite brush to use powder with. Like, this is the only brush that I have found that works like a god. Morphe 25G palette. I recently got this in the mail, like about two weeks ago. I totally begged Andre to get it for me, and he bought it for me. So this is what the... 25g grand glam palette looks like it is fucking beautiful and the pigment and everything about it is just so sinking pretty and i just oh god this is my first time using it i've swatched it for of course for instagram and like social media purposes but like i have not used it yet so i'm excited and i'm gonna pack the inner corner of my eye with a champagne gold color do like a neutral color so I'm gonna do this and just do this on the outer corner of my eye this is the NYC something I have no idea it, honestly you can tell I pet it for a while because it has no label on it I just kind of go in there just a little bit front and back pick up a little bit of product and then I smooth it out on the back of my hand so that way it's not gonna show up blotchy when I try to do my brows. Next thing I'm gonna do is I am going to use the Real Mascara. To contour, I am going to use the same on Anastasia Meeting the Tan Contour Kit, and I use this shade. I do not remember what this shade is called. Use the Anastasia Glow Kit. Um, this is the sun dipped one. This is the sun dipped palette. So, more of my shades and shades that I can use for a girl of color. I'm using the It Cosmetics. I don't know what brush this is. Oh, this is the airbrush powder brush. Um, so, I'm just going to go in with the colored bronze, tap off the excess. Oh, Jesus, this motherfucking highlight. Okay guys, so this is my completed Valentine's makeup look. Or if you guys want to see more of this, get ready with me. Give it a thumbs up. Um, 
we're going to I have to quickly get changed because our movie starts in seven minutes so I'm gonna quickly get changed or I probably might stay in this and then I'll film just like a little bit of us going to dinner but I'm actually not gonna film at dinner um, because I just want to stay in the moment so I'll see you guys soon <laughs> Goodness today. Oh my god. We love this. Yeah, ready? Alright. So if you want to switch. So you just take some? Okay. It's not even sizzling, nothing's happening. It works. It's about to sizzle right now. Oh wait, I hear it. You just did it great. Yeah. I mean it's a, a, a tiny spice tang to it. I thought our sushi was gonna come out before the meat, but I guess. Well, I no, mean, it's just raw meat. They just gotta like bring it out to you. That is true. What's that? Can All right, guys. So we're back from dinner. Bubby, say hi. Hi. And it's ten o'clock now. I have two hours. No, one hour. Two hours to finish my discussion post tonight. So I need to get that out of the way. Uh, see that we went to Easy Bon Buffet. Um, it was okay. <laughs> the experience was definitely a one and I think it's so cool that you'll be able to like cook your food in front of you. So that was pretty awesome. Um, the food itself though was just subpar in my opinion, um, but it was definitely worth the experience. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. It's been an incredible two days. I've enjoyed my two days. It felt like a luxurious like little getaway, even though it was home and I got to do a few little things. So that was cool. But I'm going to end the vlog and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.